Hello everybody, welcome back to V-Belt and Son. So today's video is going to be a little bit all over the place. Uh, time zone is going to be a little bit hopping in here and there. But I want to explain the video before you guys watch it. But it uh, let's talk about Taylor a little bit. Heck of a good girlfriend. Uh, she, she surprises me. She's still surprising me. So that is a good thing. But we had the power window switch on her truck was acting up a little bit. Ordered a new one. I never got a chance to install the thing. Girl went ahead and took the initiative. Watched some YouTube videos, learned how to do it, and went and installed it on her own. She even took a time lapse of it and sent it to me with a little smirk at the beginning, like, I know what's going on. This video I tried making it the other night, aside from being proud of Taylor for helping with that, but I needed to do the brakes on her truck, so aside from putting my new bumper on, I thought I would go ahead and knock out the brakes on her truck first, but lo and behold, I could not resist. I had to put the bumper on my truck, so... Uh, <laughs> it took a while to get that thing on there nice and perfect, but we got it on. Only did the front set of brakes on her truck, but then I got to thinking, gosh dang, you know, she's getting all macho driving that truck. She's got to be able to work on it a little bit. So, uh, I thought I would talk her through the paces and get her to change the rear brakes on the truck for herself. And she, she kept up with it. She knocked them out. She changed the whole brakes on one side. I did the other side while she was working on a little teamwork action, but... She knocked them out. Disc brakes are super easy to change, so that helps out a lot. But she got it done. This video is going to be about my girlfriend working on her Dodge. Dodge Cummins. Girlfriend driving a Cummins. Girlfriend owning her own Cummins. Man, that is that's a good line right there. I never thought I would actually have a girlfriend that would own her own Cummins. Or want to drive one full time. So that's kind of ridiculous on its own. But go ahead and enjoy the video, guys. Thanks for watching. What project we can work on tonight? We'll just do the key test for each round in the pockets a little bit and whatever keys come out first. Let's go with that one. Buddy, buddy. Well, the magic winner for tonight's video is Taylor's truck. I'll be danged. It's a Dodge, too. Go figure. Let's go ahead and do some TLC stuff to it. First of all, let's get these freaking clotheslines out of the way. We have plans for this truck, ladies and gentlemen. And tonight's plans, uh, mandatory issue that needs to be knocked out. Got to put some new old brake shoes on, old girl. We shall be doing that this evening. I uh, probably should have done it right off the bat, but this has been pushed off long enough. Went cheap on these. We're going to see how they do. $50 full set of brakes off of eBay. Not going to do anything with the rotors. This thing, uh, it's driving. It's got nice rotors. So we'll leave that alone. But let's go ahead and pop these off and go ahead and put the new brakes on there. Start timing.
breaker bar somewhere. Hang on, let me get the bigger bar so you can get some power. I was gonna say, is my weight enough? Probably not. Or I'll see. See how tight you actually went? Yeah. Think you get enough power out of that one? <laughs> Don't put it so straight up and down. That way you can get some power on it. No. Take it off and click it over one. There you go. That way you can get some. Oh, there. Click it over like six then. There, now you can get some power, some leverage. Get it, get it. She wants to drive one of these trucks. She's got to learn how to do something on it. I did the front brakes the other night before I did the bumper. But I was like, you know what? It's not that big of a deal. Teach her how to do some of these brakes. Go over there, tighten the other side now. Come on now. Come on now. Brakes were, had a little bit of life left in them, but Better early than failure. Oh God. Go the wrong way. Go the wrong way. Have you really? Yeah. <laughs> Get that part out. It's, it's, it's righty tidy, Taylor. Righty tidy. <laughs> What can we say about this truck, Taylor? You like driving it? I do. She does. Step on the truck for some reason. Uh, she put California plates on it. Go figure. She had issues getting it into California because it was an Oregon truck with a Nevada title, but DMV pushed it through somehow. And uh, she's cocky because the truck's in her name until she talks to her financial distributor. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, you got to put the hubcaps on now. But truck is still in negotiation on uh, hitting that pothole out the road. Just dent the exhaust, maybe make it fall off. Fuel mileage upper, that's what we're after. But other than that, truck's doing good. All the check engine lights are staying off. Uh, that was uh, a pretty big um, scare in the beginning. Getting codes for harmless stuff realistically in the end. So hopefully everything stays good. Some of the codes were emission related. So let's knock those off the truck before we even have to worry about that again. Other than that, um, truck's doing good. Thought I found a set of tires and wheels for it, but not quite. Till then, she's just gonna daily drive this Larry. So, uh, I don't know. Making their old girlfriend do some work on her vehicle. She did all right. She got nice and dirty. So she's gonna have to get cleaned up again. We're gonna head out to some uh, birthday party stuff for me. So thanks guys for watching. Check out the website, vbeltonsun.com. Purchase some stuff, help out the channel. Appreciate it. Like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Thanks, bye.